Hello Aries, welcome back to I Enigma. I Enigma going to be doing your journal reading for 2024. Let's see the highlights. We'll see the current energies, what's going to happen, upcoming events, and guidance in a nutshell. Please know that this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate. So take what resonates and what does not resonate. For accurate personal readings, white spells and premium charge crystals, feel free to reach out to me on WhatsApp, Instagram and email. <clears throat> All the details are given down below in the description box. Check out more on my Instagram. Follow my Instagram to stay connected with me for more stuff at iligma.in. All right, what is happening? Three of Swords, Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, what we are signs in Aries or Cross Watchers can watch this. Let's see the messages. Whoa. Okay. Um, I always cover recent past, current situation, and the future mainly future okay so what i'm sensing over here is that i can see you completely changed it took you some good years or few months to change okay i feel like it took some few months uh, to change your uh, uh self to move on from something to be happier to be uh successful to be um to start a new journey to start a new chapter to start a new job whatever it is i feel for the luck to come in your favor it took you time but i feel like now around march 2024 you will see your luck changing pretty fast okay i'm seeing everything is going to be so beautifully coming towards you with ease and you will grab opportunities with full open arms you will manifest big things in life the color purple i'm also sensing that you're passionate with the color red to pursue your um dreams you're following your intuition and intuition and inner desire with confidence and the color black you're also hiding your plans you're not uh showing the world people are seeing you as someone that is just the same but the truth is there's a lot going on in your life that is changing you with each minute each moment you're changing okay you're going to the next level it may not appear because you don't want to show the world, look, I'm changing. Look, this is what is happening to me. You just want to be low-key right now. But what people are not seeing or not realizing that you're changing every moment, okay? And changing for good. You're uplifting yourself. You're uplifting your spirits. This is you. So it's not like you want someone to bring that happiness in your life, to feel good, to feel happy, feel satisfied, to fulfill all your wishes. You have become that independent person that believes in yourself to achieve big things big goals big dreams in your life now what happened is the moon and the three of swords you recently came out of a bad relationship some of you came out of it a few years back but what i'm seeing is there was some hurt okay because the deception was caused i feel there was a deception from this person and they, they were deceiving they hurt you so you decided to separate ways with this person it took you a long time probably three months to come out of it but now that you moved on, you're doing your own thing, there's someone that is grieving in pain in your, uh, in your memory. They miss you like anything. This person is just not okay. Okay, they're feeling cold. They're feeling windy. There is no warmth. There is no sunshine in their life. They, just, they sleep a lot. They eat less or they eat a lot. It is something like, I feel like they're, they're in this deep misery right now without you they're feeling emotionally um, low drain very low vibrational person okay since the day you walked away i feel like this person is just not doing well so i'm seeing that they're going through a time where they don't know what to do in their life or where they are right now they're just lost okay and this person strongly wants you but they can't be with you because they're not confident enough to maintain the connection Okay, that is also what is going on in this person's head. They could be a Cancer. Some of you are Sagittarius. But the ending has caused this person some sort of a trauma. They didn't expect you will leave. Let's see what happened in the past that caused them this and what is happening now. I'm also seeing you taught them a lesson. Like you get respect when you give respect. So now this person understood. They were not giving you respect. Okay. So maybe this is someone that is highly influential, wealthy, okay? And they got attracted to you in the first place because you look attractive. You, you take good care of yourself. 
and there were lots of hopes so i feel like you always felt that this person was talking to other people you had this fear that something was being hidden like this person was hiding something from you and you were conscious of asking this person openly because you didn't want any kind of fight or separation you were expecting this person to change with your love but it didn't happen they thought that you will never come to know but the truth is this person was always looking for other people outside this connection so this caused you to break off because in a way you were losing self worth and the control over yourself and this person was completely uh about themselves they're completely lost in their own life doing their own thing you know they were just immature i feel like this person was always unavailable because they had a work like that they had to travel around so this person was wealthy they had work um priorities as well some way you felt like you were not being uh given that kind of importance that you expect from your person so this is what happened and for the sake of your peace and your self respect you decided to walk away from this connection what happened after then there you go this person has been looking for you since the day you left so the, since the no contact thing this person has been looking for you they cannot take their eyes off of you they just cannot stop thinking about you but the communication has ended it has stopped and this person is just not okay to take this okay they're not liking this no contact situation they somehow want to contact back and they're secretly watching you what is happening in your life now and what's going to happen next there you go aries aries this person you know that they're trying to reach out somewhere i feel like you may have heard this person sending you a message saying hi you may have heard from this person a little bit like they're trying to initiate conversation but you don't give a damn to this person that's how you're coming off like you're not interested you're uh you've taken a decision you want to stick to it not give you're not giving this person any chances anymore you're not allowing any kind of drama again so you what you've decided is to not talk to this person no matter how much you still feel or not you're not going to talk so what is happening i'm also seeing that you're very focused in making a change in your career front i'm seeing like you're putting efforts even though the money may not be good today but very soon i'm seeing you're reaching that point if you stay consistent with your work let's see what's happening in the near future for my beautiful oh aries some are new you grab this new person's attention someone new is liking this someone new is getting attracted to us they, they could be younger they could be more childlike childlike in the sense like this is someone that is not very serious when they come okay but has the ability to fall in love when the time is right okay in the divine timing you you can make this person fall in love you can make anyone fall in love so aries you're in this energy where you're vibing so high and you're doing good i'm also seeing in the near future your money is going to be um uh making you stable making you feel financially independent you're going to feel a lot more confident happier and there will be money growing everywhere and you will feel like you're never at a financial loss ever you feel like there's always a solid foundation you you can feel confident you can feel grounded you can feel humble at the same time you're able to take good care of your uh, finances you're managing it well you're not like spending like a fool you're not doing that but you're being careful i feel like you look very good these days aries it's like you're also attracting attention of all the other types all the all people okay in general people look at you when you walk by when you pass by people look at you but there's this one person whose attention you strongly captured maybe they were going in a different way they were going in a different direction but when they uh saw you they started go coming towards you they started you know getting more attracted they're losing themselves i feel like there's someone that has this, this love puppy love for you and is just coming and wants to see how things go like there's someone that is literally thinking dreaming about you or will be they go we are scorpio pisces cancer let me see more about this you also come off in the near future you feel you come off like right now as i told you it doesn't seem like your life is changing for the people looking at you they feel like oh this is the same aries is doing the same 
But in the near future, I'm seeing you appearing as someone that is wealthy, someone that is successful, someone that is lucky um, at a high position, more powerful position. And uh, you're giving orders, you're at a leadership position, and people are looking up to you and getting inspired. And they see like how lucky, look at them, Aries, how lucky they are. Okay, so that's how you appear in the near future. So write down the comment section, I'm becoming financially independent, I'm rich, I'm healthy, I'm wealthy, I'm happy. Okay, so this is how your position is going to be. And when this person comes into your life with the Knight of Cups and with the Ace of Cups, oh my gosh, there's like a breath of fresh air. This person's coming with a breath of fresh air. You're making this person, you know, crazy with puppy love. Ooh, I feel like the love is growing and becoming more magnified. And they're falling in love. So there's someone that is in love with you or is going to be in love with you is going to come towards you. I'm seeing in March or April okay or january 2024 some of you just met this person either ways i'm seeing duration is something that you cannot uh fix for each and every one it's different but yes i'm definitely seeing that there is love flourishing someone is coming with lots of love and respect towards you they could be a person coming from overseas as well i feel you come off as someone that is in love with yourself you love peace you're a diehard peace lover and that gives you confidence. You don't want any kind of arguments. You don't want any kind of disagreements and anything like that. You just want peace. You want uh, sweet talking. You want smooth conversations. And you, you feel confident. You feel happier. This is what you're right now. And you're spreading love. This is how this person sees you. And you're a lover of nature. Now, let's see this. Five of swords and the eight of swords. Okay, I feel like the past is trying to come back in different ways. They're also trying to manipulate you so that you get them back. But in the end of the day, what you're doing is blocking this person finally. So you're going to block this past. But I feel like there's a possibility that the past is trying to come back and initiate conversation. And at one point of time, this will irritate you and you will, in the end of the day, are going to block this person. So finally, there's a proper closure to the other person. They're also getting a proper closure and you're moving on. Wow. Let me see. What is like, give me more clarity about five of swords and eight of swords for my Aries. Yes, eight of wands. Your life is moving so fast. You're grabbing attention of people so much that people, other people are getting jealous, especially your ex. There's, there's a lot of jealousy around. So don't get affected. Just ignore that. And if you just can um, keep an eagle eye and mind your own business there's nothing in the world that can affect you or uh even energetically it won't affect you okay so you're rising i feel like you're beating your counterparts in compet competition and you're rising about them like you were somewhere like you were here and your friends or other people that you were cherishing were here and now it's like this the graph has gone up and suddenly everybody's looking at you and they're like wow how did the series uh change so much like your whole personality is going to change i would not say change really you're already very good it's just enhancing you're getting better and better and your competition is leaving behind i see what else is going to happen in the near future in 2024 the magician you have the power in your hands whatever you want to manifest just write it down and start working on it it will be 100 percent manifested sun moon rising or venus across watches it will be 100% manifested. Whatever your heart is asking you to do, please follow your heart. Do not ignore. This is your inner voice, inner instinct that is telling you to do this. Go for it. Only thing you need is self-confidence and that you have. Passion is there. It's time for you to take whatever tool you require to make your wish come true. And there you go. Bang on. 2024 is going to be the time where you're going to come up with a great big uh, shocking achievement. Okay. I'm also seeing the person that's coming in love could be a Libra Gemini Aquarius. All right. Keep uh, claiming whatever good part comes in. Okay. So what I'm seeing is it's time to completely stop looking for answers from something that needs to leave your life. Like you're still trying to find answers about someone that did you wrong even though you don't want to do anything to do with this person you don't have anything to do with this person but you still want to find why did they do this 
or what, what is their what is their plan or this so that i feel like you're going to close yourself from all those kind of thought processes because yes there will be someone that's trying to break you every time you know they can see you doing well especially your ex i feel like this person when they see you moving on finding someone else they'll try to come in between grab your attention but it will always be like they'll feel ignored by you so you're gonna ignore the past completely whatever is in the past you're going to ignore it completely the sun and the ace of pentacles a clear message that there's a lot of confidence within you and there's a new beginning a solid new star that's going to come into your life a lot of money with a lot of health wealth happiness success good relations and you're going to go out and also do good for yourself like you will also take care of your skin your health your exercise routine, your diet, your sleep, everything, your friendships, your relationships, you will cherish all of these things and it will blossom. I feel like with time, I feel everything is just getting more cleared out. All the purification, toxification, detoxification has been done and now you're ready for a new start. So I'm seeing a promotion. I'm seeing the highest achievement coming to you as well in 2024. Aries. Aww. I can see this person. You see through this person's heart. Like there's someone that comes with pure heart and love. I'm seeing this. This it's time for you to start dating. I feel like you will have a lot of options, but you're the one that will decide who you want to go with. So you will have a lot of people coming towards you. But I'm seeing you're gonna fall in love with that one particular person that has a huge heart and is coming with puppy love. So you will have options. Like don't ignore these options. You never know where your soulmate, how your soulmate is going to be coming into your life. But your major focus should not be about finding love, uh, about finding happiness in love uh, in a partner. You should start looking for happiness within you, being a complete person, having the people around you, whoever that care for you. That should be where your uh, true happiness should lie. Okay. I'm also seeing these options trying to impress you, fighting with each other for you. For some of you, not all. But yes, this is happening. Yes. So you can see the two things. First of all, I'm seeing main male and main female. That means you're going to meet the one. Okay. The one that um, that's heart, that whose heart beats for you. Okay, and I'm seeing they handing you a rose with the ace of pentacle that came in earlier. I'm seeing this possibility of engagement as well. So you guys are going to be like um, loving each other. I feel like you'll, you'll meet your counterpart in this person. You are the same for this person. So I'm seeing you'll receive an unexpected message when you're at work. Okay, about this person. They will express their feelings. All right, and I'm seeing this going to be a house visit also. Okay, some of you are going to buy a big house if you're planning on that, then this is a good time that you will find a bigger house for yourself. I'm sensing there is a church in your city or a temple or, a, or any, any sacred place in your city, anywhere nearby that universe wants you to go and pray over there every Sunday. That's, this is what I'm getting. You should and see the change in you so what i'm seeing is finding the truth crushed me i feel like your ex is gonna find everything about what's going on in your life and they'll figure out that you're with someone new and it's gonna crush them well we will be together again so yes the ex is not done i feel like they'll still try to come towards you and try to win you over but you are done with this you're done you don't want to deal with them anymore they're acting childish Maybe it was a person that you had children with for some of you or there was a childhood with this person. But what is in the past is in the past. You don't want. Yes, it's oh, it's over for you. It's like you, you just don't want this. But this person is still trying to work things out and they want to build your trust. They want to, you know, um, they want to build trust with you. They want to tell you that you can trust them this time. They're acting like a child, like they don't want to go. I feel like someone is going to cry on your lap you know, asking for another chance, but you're done, okay? You trust, you don't trust this person, in short. You have zero trust over this person. One last message, please. You might not know now, but you will. So wait for 2024. I'm seeing like right now you should be 
uh, taking little steps or making big changes in your life you'll see those big changes everybody will see those big changes in 2024 it's going to be a massive and i'm seeing big achievements for you and i'm definitely seeing that the outcome is going to be way more than what you expect so this is about you aries i hope you enjoyed this wonderful reading thank you for your time please do like share comment and subscribe to ionigma bye